It's Monday, May the 6th, I think. We're charging. First spin, 2024. Hopefully tomorrow afternoon, the tide will be low. And that's my firecracker, Lambo. He's a cool dog. Maybe the coolest dog I ever owned in my entire life. You know, we uh, we really worked on the fig tree. We pruned it and pruned it, and it's uh, a <laughs> it's made a miraculous recovery, which I knew it would, because it always does. The leaves are bigger. We got lots more growth. We, I didn't think it was would fill out nearly as much as it did. But we got new growth here. All this is new growth, inner growth, I call it, which I never had before. Look. <laughs> it's going to be Figzilla again, I guess. I'm truly amazed, this, this fig tree. <laughs> I don't know. Great. Googa mooga. You have to see how it goes, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a lot of knives. Oh, well, I'll take that back. It hasn't been a lot of knives. It's been a few knives. Farmers markets, uh, the first one was pretty busy. I think we had uh, almost a ripper. The next one was we got a half a ripper. We got a new bird feeder. So the big birds can't get in there and rob all the food. It's got different seeds in it. But this one over here has got... Sunflower seeds, not sunflower. I forget what kind they are, but just for little birds. They tore their house down. They didn't tear it down. They completely stripped the house next to us, inside and out. And they've been remodeling it ever since. I think it would be pretty nice. They kept the walls and the roof, and cut the roof up and modified it a lot. But like I said, the markets have been slow. We had uh, Saturday market, we only did like 23. We had a big block of knives come in at 11.55. That helped us, but I had to bring them home. We got a... Uh, supposed to be bringing me some knives today. So I've been kind of taking it easy a little bit which is okay. You're a firecracker. Yes, you are a firecracker. Look at this firecracker. He's a firecracker. Yes, you are a little firecracker. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Do right? you believe it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're a firecracker, all right. You the damnedest firecracker I've ever seen. And here's my grasshopper right here. And Lambo has really brought her back to life. When Jack passed away, man, she fretted and fretted and fretted. I've already told you all this sort of. But she's happy now. We had a big rainstorm. I mean, the streets were full of water and everything last night. It's cleared up now. No, not much going on. My daughter's going to come in town from first week in June for about two weeks. From she lives in Colorado for my birthday. She's bringing her dog. His name is Chief. Yeah, Chief. That's where he stays right here. I sit right there. He stays right there. <laughs> You a firecracker, look at him. He rolls right over and he wants his tummy rubbed. That's all he lives for. Yeah, he rubs his tummy. If it wasn't for his tummy, I don't know what he'd do. Yes, you are. You a firecracker. You a firecracker. <laughs> okay, I guess that's it. 
Everybody's doing okay? We're eating okay? I, 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 sit down there, firecracker. <laughs> what do you want? What do you want, firecracker? You want to give me a kiss? Are you a firecracker? He's a loving little boy. Yes, he is. He's a loving little boy. You some firecracker. Say hi, everybody. I'm uh, I'm Lambo. <laughs> okay, I'll get back to you. You all stand by.